today is January 4th, and I've got a big box to show you guys. I'm serious. The box is 18 by 12 by 12, and I am really excited about it and so thankful. Kit from All Things Crochet and Knit with Kit is de-stashing, and she sent me some of her yarn. I'm so excited. I'm so grateful. Uh, I had some ske skeins of wool that I had won um, in different um, giveaways. I won one from Christie's Creations or two, and I just don't do wool, and I'm in Florida, and I know that Kit likes wool. So I, whenever I get nice wool products, I like to send them to all things crochet and knit with Kit. She lives in Illinois. So here goes the big box, you guys. I already opened, but I didn't peek. Here's the big box, you guys. You can't even see me because I can't even see you. So let's move it down some. I opened the top, but I didn't look. Here goes. Oh my goodness. I'm going to be saying that a lot, I think. <laughs> O-M-G. Oh, first off, we're starting with some tea and stickers. Drink, I drink, and I knit things. Oh, it's so cool. Isn't that cool? It's purple, you guys, the ones that like purple. Purple. And there is... Two kinds of tea, apple fresh and peach passion fruit. And what I like to do, these are black tea from London. And what I like to do is I like to make them cold. I like to put it in a pitcher of water and let it steep or whatever the terminology is in the fruit trainer. Because <laughs> I prefer cold because I'm in Florida. Okay, you guys. Oh, there's some stitch markers. I make everything. You can stri survive anything. Look at these stitch markers. Aren't they cool? One has a cactus, and then one is like a star, and they have the lever backs. I wonder if she made these. I don't know because there's no logo or anything on here. Um, very cute. Very, very cute. Then there's cakes and all kinds. Of, oh, there's a candle. Is that a candle or is it soap? Soap. Olive oil soap with Greek honey. Pink champagne. You're not going to believe this. On Sunday, which was the first, we went to Tarpon Springs in Florida, and it is a Greek town. We had um, dinner at a Greek restaurant called Hella's, and I brought home some baklava cheesecake. Oh, so good. Greek. Olive oil. Love it. Now, there is a kit in here from Mary Maxim. Textured diamond blanket. Oh my goodness, look at this yarn. And let's see what kind of yarn it is. It is Royal, I guess I'll have to unzip it so I can see what kind of yarn it is. Where's the zipper? Don't you love these packs? Okay. Oh my goodness, there's four skeins of each color blue and pink and it is I don't want to take it out too far royal just says royal from Zeman very soft and it's that oak KO tech um 100% acrylic and it comes with the pattern I just love Mary Maxim I'm in the next day or so. I think I'm going to be getting my Mary Maxim Afghan Club 
kit for the fourth quarter of 2021. So I'm looking forward to seeing what that's all about. And so this pattern is a baby blanket and it's really textured. I should have took the pattern out, right guys? It looks like it might be knitted. It is, it's knitted. So this must be the knit club that she got one time. You guys, there's so much fun stuff in here. This, oh my goodness, what is this? This is number four. Five, I believe, I hope. What is it? Oh, it's a number five bulky. Good, because I'm going to make another one of them hats um, that I made uh, out of the Ogo. I just love that pattern. And there's two skeins in here. Thank you so much. This is, I love this, Chunky. And the colorway is Mocha. Mocha, I like Mocha. Very nice. I'm just going to toss them on the bed. Okay, then we have two cakes. The cakes are Yarn B Katrina Bright Violet. Is that the color shade, I guess? Yep, Bright Violet. Okay, there it is. And it is a number three. So there's a number three weight. Aren't they beautiful? I hope the shadow isn't taken away from it. And what is this? This is a number three also. So this is cream, ice cream scoop. Oh, I see. And the color weight is Superman. Can you believe it? Superman. And there's a blanket pattern here. I think I made this blanket pattern before. Uh, it's a number three, if I didn't say that. And there's two large skeins of this in here. So, um, does it say the name of this pattern here? Um, but I'm pretty sure I've made this pattern before. And ice cream, big scoop, Superman. There's two of those. I'm just going to leave those in the bottom. And then there's four of these oh my goodness you guys premier candy shop 100 acrylic number four and don't you just love this when they're two together like this and she's got four cakes these two are almost like matching that's pretty cool and then these two have different centers oh my goodness and ice cream, not ice cream, just ice, ice yarns. Okay, so what is this? This, oh, is beautiful. This is a number three, and it is 15% mohair, 35% acrylic, and 40% polyamide, with 10% metallic, because it has... Sparkles. I don't know if you can see it. And the colorway is turquoise, pink, lilac, and green, and maroon. <laughs> so they just spelled out all the colors that's in the yard. Isn't that beautiful? And so there's eight of these. Gorgeous. Oh my goodness. Kit, thank you so much. It's so beautiful. Everything is just, each color is just more beautiful than the rest. Oh my goodness. Okay, so let me show you some of my makes. Okay, I'm working on this blanket, you guys. I hope you can see the squishy texture of it. I'm using um, the Hug This yarn, the DMC Hug This that comes with the different uh, stuffed animals. And this is the one that comes with the, what is it, bear. This is the blue that comes with the bear. And then I added some of this Bernat Baby Sport in the color pink, I think it probably is. Um, let's see. Washable acrylic baby pink. That's what it is. And it's a number three. So I'm holding the two strands together and I'm using a K hook, and it's real squishy. 
And I want to show you the pattern. There's a YouTube video for this. Uh, the pattern is called uh, White Wave DJ Blanket. And she has a tutorial. And I looked it up under Easy Baby Blanket, but it actually came up under White Wave. And I printed out her pattern. And she has the um, tutorial on YouTube. So it's working out really good. Um, I have only one more of the hug this left and it's the monkey and my plan is to mix some white yarn with it and just do half double crochets holding two strands together because I want to get those out to the babies um our ch charity here through our cl clubhouse on uh, the lady barb hi barb I know she doesn't watch but anyway um she met the midwives at the heart of Florida maternity ward. And to me, that's so cool. And, oh, and speaking of shout outs, Jennifer from Cinnamon Stitches watched my video, the one that I had on the shirt, one of her shirts. And she said, thank you for the support. Jennifer watched my video. I can't believe I'm so excited. Uh, I'm also working on a corner to corner. If you remember the peacock yarn, um, I'm working on that. I'm trying to get it done this week. And after I get it done this week, then I have to start on my cruise homework. So far, the cruise is going. Uh, today's January 4th. So January 12th, we have to start doing our online check-in. Check -in. So I'm looking forward to that. And they already um, verified our COVID status. So um, I'm making a corner-to-corner -corner black blanket and I'll be showing you my project my progress on that I have to do 24 squares and I'll be posting the pattern and if you guys want to kind of do a make along with me you'll know I've been work I'll be working on it because what we have to do is try to finish the squares before we go on board February 26th and then as a conversation starter we're supposed to be joining the squares. So I'm looking forward to starting that. And I've got several days to do it. But 24 squares is going to take a while. Okay, guys, I'm going to come in here, show you my box from Kit. Thank you so much, Kit. Hug, hug, hug. Hug to all my subscribers, my new subscribers. Um, I'm less than 200 away from a thousand, so that would be fun if we could meet that goal in 2022. And so I'm gonna, like I said, I'm gonna finish um, that corner to corner in Peacock, and then I'm gonna start. So you'll you'll hear from me next when I'm doing that. I got all my items uh, for my inventory restocked that I sold in the four craft shows and online that I did. So I got my inventory built back up, and now it's time to move on to other projects. So love you guys. 